G'day everyone, welcome to episode 2 of Animals. In this episode, oh, I hope that intro turned out okay. In this episode, I have got a plan. I've got a plan. So, there it is. I have installed a mod, it's called Online Picture Frame Mod, and it allows me to do this. Oh wait, no, 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 not that, not that. This. Ah. Hey. There we go, there's the plan. Okay, uh, this doesn't have to be in order, but I've sketched up a little path and extension and the sun. So, here's, the, here's what I pretty much want to do in this episode. I want to add an extension to the house, so this part here is a garden bed, and I want to add a little up, more upstairs, a better upstairs than this. So, I want to go in the wall here, go in a bit. And, yeah, I want that to happen. I also want to build a path going around, and this will be to the entrance, or one of the entrances to the zoo. Probably my entrance from my house, but I'll probably build an official entrance. So, yeah. And I do want to build the bear a home. It, he, he does need one, and he is being a very good bear. But it, that does mean taming him, which I do have a fishing rod and I've got to catch some salmon to tame him. So I'll be doing that a bit later. But first off, I want to quickly run over here. Up, up, up. I want to decide. Sorry, I had to cough there. A bit of asthma. So this is where I'm going to put the extension and I'm going to make the garden go around into the hill. But it, rem it means removing some of this hill here, which I'm okay with doing. I just might do a small little time lapse of me doing it. So I'm going to start that right now. Alright, I'm quite happy with this part. I added a roof, it's it's a bit tall, I'm going to do the interior soon. I'm not 100% sold on how it looks on the outside, but I like it overall. It'll, it'll definitely look better once I add the garden bed over here and then the path going around. It'll, it'll start to come to shape. But before I get to this guy, which I want to do next, I need to address something. Okay, so last night I got a call from a friend saying, Hey, do you want to play some Minecraft? Of course, I said, yeah, because I haven't talked to any of my friends all day. So I hopped on, changed my version of Minecraft to go play with them. And then this morning I joined back into this world because I, I wanted to start recording again for this next part. But I didn't have my mods on because I was in a different version of the game. So everything was very... Purple and black, it's, but now um, I got the mods back and I've got the world back. But the parts that weren't loaded in previously, the chunks of the world that weren't loaded in previously. Oh, look at the bird. <laughs> I'm sorry, I got distracted. Um, the chunks that weren't previously loaded in uh, have now 
turned into vanilla Minecraft chunks. And I can't actually show you them because of the porcupine and it'll prick me. But this is all vin... What is that up there? There's a pig of some sort. Um, this is all normal Minecraft chunks. And that isn't bad. It just means that there's no more bones. There are plenty outside of the parts I've already loaded in. And it's also a good thing because it's fixed the problem I was having where mobs weren't spawning. So, that's, that's, that's great. I'm happy for that. And when I say mobs, I mean animals, like zoa animals and overworld animals. Because I've only seen a few cows in this world. And that's it. But now we've got chicken, sheep, all that spawning in. And it's all, it's all fixed. So... That, that's great and also someone suggested a mod to me in the description I think it's called better animals better animal models mod and it just changed the models of normal minecraft animals so this is a normal chicken except it's got a different texture and I personally like it and I also could make an enclosure out of like the sheep or the cows or the pigs it just adds a lot more for me to do. So, yeah, thank you to the person who suggested it. Um, you know who you are. Hello, sorry to interrupt you, but this is a bit awkward because the recording file is corrupted and I have no idea what to do with them other than cut this part out of the video. And the bad part is, it's a big part of the video because I got a fair bit done. I got all the kibble ready, um... I finished uh, decorating the house and I added the garden and pathway in but I haven't made the bear house yet so that's going to be the rest of the video. I haven't tamed the bear yet either but yeah I thought I should add this part in because it would be a ma random massive cut in between recordings and yeah. I'm sorry. Uh, get back to the video. <laughs> I'm sorry. Yeah, so this is a bit awkward, isn't it? Well, um, I got the the kibble room done. This is what I'm calling it, because this is where I'm going to be crafting all the kibble, which I have all the stuff ready to do, so... Um, don't have anything up here. And I've also got the path. So, as you heard, the, the, the recording corrupted. It was something like... 23,860 hours long recording apparently. I didn't record for that long, but that's how much it says it is. And every time I try and put it into the editing, it just crashes the editing. So, yeah, um, that, that happened. Um, so I didn't tame the bear, which is what I want to do next. So I should probably make the kibble. But then after that, I want to make the the bear house. So, I hope this isn't too much gone in one video. I hope I can still make it a good video. Yeah. Okay. i got to remember. Okay, so I need apple. Apple is probably the hardest part other than the fish. I need carrot. Okay, so unfortunately I was only able to get 9 apples because it took so long and I did a montage of me chopping down trees and also I, I did a montage of me getting everything so now like downstairs I have a chicken farm. Well, chickens, not chicken farm, but they're all sitting down here. Um, and just over the lake I have a bunch of cows. Here they are. Okay, so I actually want to try my best to keep one of the kibbles. So I'm only going to make eight. And I have enough for nine, but <laughs> I'm going to keep one. Because I want to make this book here. And it costs one kibble. So, yeah, that's a thing. And bloop. There we go. Bear kibble. Hopefully... I don't need that much, even though I just made that much. I guess it's always good to have a little bit extra. Um, but here we go. I'm going to go tame the bear. I'm going to do it while he's sleeping as well. <laughs> there 
There we go. Oh my god. I have a pet bear. This is amazing. I don't know what to do right now. <laughs> okay, so now I need a... What's it called? A data book. And I can make that really easily. Just with a normal book and the kibble that I just got. So like this. Blip, blip. Do, 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 do. There we go. Data book. I'm going to go swoop him right up. Nice. Okay. This is where I'm actually going to build his house. Right above a lava lake. Because he does love this lava lake. It's it's the reason he, he chose this spot. Because there's a nut lovely lava lake. Sorry if I sound like I'm rushing this. I sort of am. Because I need to get this video out. And that part there took me a good hour to to try and fix and I didn't get any progress so um yeah so that's very painful that that happened but I can still live through it it's it's not the end of the world so this is where I'm gonna put him or her sorry uh I've made a little ledge here and once I finish talking, I'm going to go into a time lapse. I do really quickly want to say that I'm a bit stressed over things that are happening, but I'm still trying my best to get this video out tonight. So sorry if I sound a bit off, it's because I'm rushing. But I will still try and put my best effort into making this house looking really good. But I'm going to go into a time lapse real quick of me building the house so yeah see you after the time lapse <laughs> Alright, I'm back and I'm in a little bit of a better mood. I was quite depressed before out of because of everything that was happening. Uh, but I realised I didn't really show you the data book, which I will do right now. So I'm going to put the grizzly bear in. And she's sleeping. It's a girl, by the way. Um, she doesn't have a name yet and her trait is lax. I don't really know what lax is. So the higher this bar is, is the h how hungry she is, so she's good in hunger. Water is going down, and that is enrichment, so next episode I think we'll get all the enrichment items for this bear. And these are the enrichment items, and these are everything eat that she eats. So yeah, I tried to make this door big enough for her to fit through. She'll definitely fit through this, and I made a little star at the top. So, yeah, I'm sorry if you made it the whole way through this video. I, I feel bad because this definitely isn't my best video. Um, but the series can't continue without this video, can it? So, yeah. Um, leave a name suggestion for her. She She's sleeping and I'll definitely add some furniture in the next episode. I've just got to get this video out. I can't waste any more time. 
So, yeah. <laughs> I don't, I'm saying so yeah a lot in this video, but I, I, I'm, I'm tired. I just want to get this done. Okay. So, um, thank you for watching the video. If you made it the full way, please let me know if you made it the full way and didn't stop halfway through because it's a terrible video. Um, that's all I have to say. Bye-bye. Thank you. Take care.